Okay guys, so today we're gonna be adding and we are gonna be using a variety of strategies. And so this strategy that we're going to use right now is we are going to build it using base 10 blocks and then we are going to stretch it out using expanded form. So the first thing I wanna do is, is I wanna look at 468. I'm gonna actually draw this out. I'm gonna draw 400 blocks to represent 400, six longs to represent um, our tens, and then eight ones, okay? And to represent 853, I'm going to just simply do the same thing, eight hundreds. Didn't make, I didn't pick easy numbers. Six, seven, eight and then five longs and three ones, okay? I'm also going to put these in expanded notation so you guys can see um, the difference here. And what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna put it on top of each other. So 400, 60, and eight, and then below, below it, 800 plus 50 plus three, okay? And so I'm gonna do this together okay so when we add we always want to start in the ones place because if we get a digit that is greater than nine um like we know like eight plus three is eleven i cannot put eleven down here um that's not how we want to add we want to be adding like things so only one digit so no digit greater than nine can actually go here um we're not going to be bringing it down so Anyway, so let's let's look at this. So here we have eight and three. And like I said, eight plus three is eleven. So what I have to do is I can only put I can't put a digit greater than nine down here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the one from that eleven and then I'm gonna put the ten with the tens. Okay. So basically what I did is, is I'm gonna move these two over here. I'm going to combine those, and that's actually going to create a new long where I'm only left with one one in the ones place. But I got a new long here, okay, represented in this 10, okay? So now if I add these up, I know that 5 plus 6 is 11, plus 12, or plus 10 is 12, and so that would be 120. Well, put a uh, two down here for the 20s place or 20 down here because this is only my tens and so that extra 100 has to go over here so when I do that I'm putting six here plus seven eight nine ten so all of these are being combined together to form a new hundred block okay so a new 100 block represented here. And so I'm left with the two tens here, okay? Now I'm going to add up all my hundreds. Well, I have 8 plus 4 is 12, plus one more is 13. And so, but I can only have 100 here, so I can only put the 300 here. And so I have to create... Um, I have to create a new place value, which would be 1,000 for those, those, those 10 hundreds that I have. So I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So that is my new, combining all of those is my new 1,000 block. And then I'm left with 1, 2, 3 hundreds here. And so when I combine that, I get a total of 1,321. The thing is, problem is that I want you guys to see is that this is a pretty messy strategy and it's easy to get lost in the picture especially on a space that you're given on a typical assessment but this strategy of just combining like terms would help you um, to keep your work neat but then also to see where you are regrouping. Regrouping simply means I can't have more than nine and in a place value and so therefore I have to regroup and put the new 10 or the new 100 in the correct new place value okay so this is 
the expanded notation version for adding, I highly suggest you try it out.